Okay. Let's see, where do we go from here? Where do we go from here? Where do we go? Where's you? I was singing Buffy! You were interrupting my singing of Buffy! For that, you must die. Is he not following me? No, I seem to have outrun a looker. Okay, let's do this cautiously. Come on. Come on, Leon. Get right behind him. Plant that shotgun right between his ass cheeks and fire. After picking up the green herb, of course. Want another? How about a third? Wait, no, that was a Leon, bad time to reload. Might as well turn it heal now. Okay. Eat this! That is for interrupting my singing of Buffy. No one interrupts Buffy. Eh, I still can't get in here. Must be for Claire. Yeah, it's for Claire. I wonder where the hell I have to go for that, then. Huh. Maybe it's the... No, it's not the master key. But I might as well try to open that room where Sherry is. Maybe? Eh, it's along the way to the upper area. Eh, I don't know what I'm talking about. Maybe the purple room? But how do I even get... I might as well go to that room and see. If I can somehow get over to where that purple door is. Okay. Yes, I'm going the right way. We are almost done with the game, guys. We are getting closer. Now that I started singing a little bit of a Buffy song, I want to sing more music. But I'm recording a let's play, so I can't start singing, because then I'll get copy or content ID. Oh, did you just? You cannot have Leon. No, 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 no! You stay off of me, you son of. I'm on danger. I am on danger. I am no longer on danger. And he immediately grabs me again and face hugs me. I am now impregnated with plant with a plant baby. Leon is going to have a plant baby. There's probably an impreg fan fiction for that. I just rule 34, Leon. Oh god damn it. Let's just forget that ever happened and keep going. Sniffy. Sniff, sniff, sniff. Okay, I guess the key's not for there, so we might as well try the room with the purple door. If I can figure out how to get to it. <laughs> wait. Wait, wait, wait. Maybe I can take the box down the elevator? Yes, yes. Might as well try that. So the thing about Let's Playing is you start to... Uh, Speaking out loud so much, they start asking questions to the screen as if someone's going to answer. I'm not doing this live, so no one's going to answer, and I'm just talking to myself. I accidentally made my roommate think that I was going insane. Uh, what? You, no. Hi, Annette! You murdered my husband. Where have you been? I know what you're looking didn't for. Didn't murder anyone. You came for the G virus, didn't you? No. Actually, not at all. From me. This is my husband's legacy. You can have it. Now, where's that spy you were working with earlier? Spy? What you spy? Know what I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> you're so gullible. He does not a spy. I don't know what you're talking about. Agency. 
reason why she came here is to obtain the G virus. Nah, it's all lies. That's lies and slander. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check. On you did a background check on Ada. Got close to John and became his girl. How could you do a background check on Ada when she's supposed to be a spy with no information? That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do. You've known her for two hours. You don't know her. If you don't want to believe it. I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. Or Mr. X could show up and you run away. Okay, get around. He always gets at least one punch on me. Do I have any? I don't have any healing items. Good thing I'm going into a room right now that has an item box. So he doesn't follow me. An item box. Time to get some healy items together. I might as well take the F8 spray too. Just in case we come across Mr. X again in the room. And another green herb because I'm starting to get paranoid and I have a huge surplus of green herbs. Alright, what we're gonna try and do is push the box back onto the platform, take it down to the second level, and move it into that one little area of the room that doesn't look like it has anything in it. Climb onto it, get to the next door, onward to adventure, have some chocolate. I'm just now noticing the big bruise on my arm. Poke. And yes, that was an actuality, I just noticed the big old black bruise on my arm. Like, where the hell did I get that from? Mystery bruises, you ever get one of those? Of course I can't go at it from that way, I have to go from the other direction. It's okay. Little uh little Tony over there hasn't gotten up yet, so at least we won't have to worry about any zombies in the save room again. For now. The riveting gameplay of Resident Evil 2. Box simulator. There's really not much to say here. I'm just pushing the box into a corner. Okay, now onto the box, onto the next box, onward to adventure. I am brilliant. Am I correct in that this is the right place? Yes, I am. You don't know that he is useless. I know I've said that 5,000 times already, but you don't know that. I would par be paranoid keeping all keys on me at all times just in case. Okay, now what's over here? Wait a minute. I recognize this room. Hi! You you go away. Um Run! Ada, you're the one who has the G virus. You probably should also back up about now. Ada! Why did she try to reload when he was standing right in front of her? Ada, you're the worst spy ever! Oh, also, she should have broken every single bone in her body when he tossed her. <laughs> no one can survive being thrown into a metal thing hard enough to bend it Leon, without a single please broken bone. Escape. No. She should have died on impact. We're a or team. at least got knocked unconscious and then we died. I can't just leave you behind. Really? You guys are gonna do this now? I'm We've known each other for two hours. Don't say it, Ada. Don't say it. Woman who fell in love with you. Nothing. Oh God! That was the sound of me slapping my forehead with both hands. No. Oh God! Now they're kissing. I know it's a dire situation and all, and emotions are running high. But you can't uh, love some. You can't have fallen in love with someone. Love at first sight. No. Love at first sight is not a thing. Ada! Wait! Self oh great! I guess that's how it activated. All employees proceed to the body platform. 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 I will always remember you. I will always remember you. 
Goodbye. Lady I met two hours ago. What you got here? Ooh! <laughs> Why does she have the master key? I want a master key. Well, I guess this is time for me to leave. Because apparently the uh, trigger for the self-destruct mechanism in Resident Evil 2 is Ada getting thrown into something. Was that a siren outside? They're coming for me. The coppers are coming for me. Leon, Hi, Claire. Claire? Is that you? Where are you? Never mind that right now. Leon, I have to go back and get Sherry. Um, I left her in the security office. <laughs> now I have to go get Sherry for you? Claire, you're making me do everything. Wait a second. What are you going to do? Where are you going? I still have a few loose ends to take care of. I'm of course she does. You. Hello? Claire, are you Claire is always far too busy. Claire! And then she ignores me. Hello, if Leon Security has something office? to say to you, answer him, Claire. You have no reason not to. I played through that section of the game. You could have answered it. But no, Claire likes to be bossy. That doesn't change in Code Veronica. Or in Degeneration, for that matter. Anyway, as you can hear, all employees must go to the platform. I'm not an employee, we're going there anyway. But first, of course, we have to go get Sherry. Good thing she's on the way. Kind of. Itchy ear. All employees proceed to the bottom platform, platform, platform. Yes, I will push the button. We have a Sherry to go save. It probably wouldn't let me go down the emergency elevator without her. Please proceed to the bottom platform, platform, platform. Yes, we understand. We must go to the bottom platform. Hey, Sherry! Is there anything I can grab in here? Save room and an item box. I've come to get you a save before Claire's going waiting. on to the end of the game would be nice. Or not. You can just you can just take me out of the room game. Take me away from my save point. Yeah, just let's just lay her on the ground. Is that is that uh, metal flooring all nice and cozy for you there, Sherry? Everything's hurting. I understand that, honey, but I was asking if everything was comfortable. Everything's hurting. And somehow he just magically appears with her back in his hands. Okay, for a second there, it looked like something had jumped on top of the elevator because it kind of shuddered. Which is... worrying, to say the least. Well, at least we've got an er, train. What are you looking at, Leon? Oh. For a second I was saying, please don't have William Birkin on top of the train. That would be bad. Now we gotta go set Just it down. Down. Claire should be back soon. And now I think we have to go um, start the car so we can finish the game. So that'd be nice. <laughs> no. Um, oh, they're standing right in front of it. Insufficient power supply. Really, game? Fine. What's over here? Hmm. Anything of importance? Um, an item box. That's good. And this typewriter and something on the floor. How's that? Platform key. Ooh. I'm probably going to need that so I can get this power supply stuff. 
so I can start the train. That's my, that is my current objective. Okay, this is our last save, guys. Number 10 on Leon scenario. Oh boy, I can't make any more saves now from the till the end of the game. I will not let myself save anymore. Yep. No more players. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Goes away. Let's see. Might as well take some more Healy items. Just in case we come across a boss. Because getting shanked by a boss is a bad thing. Ooh. Hey Sherry, how you feeling now? Everything is hurting. Um, how else do you feel? Oh, pretty well besides that. <laughs> no, it's... You know, so far in the last, uh... Five minutes, five minutes that... Oh. Well, I guess we have five minutes to finish the game. <laughs> anyway. It seems that Leon is a better babysitter than Claire is just in the last five minutes. He's managed to get Sherry from safe room to safe room without destroying anything. Or, you know, letting her get sucked into a vent to then get impregnated by her father. That was totally Claire's fault for not paying any attention to the little girl. Good job, Claire. Okay, so I've got one of the things. Um, that's probably the place starting to explode, which is bad. Yep. Okay, we should hurry up then. Um, I think we need to put the plugs in here. Um, I need to put the... Damn it, game. 